welcome children today we are going to talk about we are going to discuss chapter number 3 from your textbooks which is word processor tabular presentation so in this chapter we are going to learn about how we can create tables in a word document and how we can perform different different formatting in a table in a document so let us first learn how we can create a table in a document so for that i am going to first open a word document so this is a word document okay this is a blank page now in this page i want to create a table okay so you should know what is a table table is nothing but a tabular presentation of our data in the form of rows and columns columns are horizontal sections and rows are uh, sorry columns are the vertical sections and the rows are the horizontal sections okay and intersection of a column and a row is called a cell intersection means where a one column and one row meets that is called one cell okay so we enter our data in each cell in a table so let us learn how we can create a table so there are number of options to which you can create a table in a word document so the first option that i am going to talk about is how using a table grid so children this is a blank document so to create a table what you have to do is at the top you see the home tab next to the home tab you have this insert tab so i will click on the insert tab when you click on insert you will see this option that says table you will click on this table option and you will see a drop down menu that opens you see this is a drop down menu so the first option that you see this small small boxes that are created this is called a table grid okay so you can create a table using this table grid how you just have to move your mouse cursor on the grids suppose if you want to create a table of three columns and three rows so you will just keep moving your mouse on the i have moved the mouse on three columns and i will move the uh, the mouse on three rows so you can see accordingly my table is created so you can just you don't have to click you just simply have to move your mouse don't click anywhere just move your mouse cursor on the number of cells that you want to create in your table suppose i want a table of 5 into 5 means 5 columns and 5 rows so i will just move the mouse over 5 columns okay and i will move the mouse over 5 rows okay so you can see accordingly a table of 5 cells means 5 columns and 5 rows is created how many cells will be there 10 cells okay five columns sorry 25 cells five columns and five rows right so this is the one way of creating a table using table grid how i created it you just have to do what you just have to you just have to go to the insert option go to table and you will just move your mouse over the number of cells that you want in your table so i want three columns three rows or four columns three rows i can just move it accordingly and click and you will get your table here on your microsoft document this is one way second way is using the insert box okay so how you do this again i want to create a table how will i do it i will just let me delete it first i will go to the insert option go to the table the second option that you say insert table i will click here here it will ask you how many number of columns and number of rows so let's say i write here five columns and i write number of rows as five okay auto fit behavior means the width width aapki jo ek ek cell hai uski width kitni honi chahiye if you set it to auto means automatically the width will be set if you set it to auto fit to contents means jitne contents jitna bada aapka content hoga accordingly aapke सेल का साइज चेंज होता रहेगा वी विल डिस्कस इट लेटर ऑन सो जस्ट यू जस्ट हैव टू एंटर द नंबर ऑफ कॉलम्स एंड नंबर ऑफ रोज हेयर एंड यू विल प्रेस ओके यू विल सी योर नंबर ऑफ सेल्स इज कॉलम्स इज फाइव नंबर ऑफ रोज इज फाइव सो यू कैन क्रिएट दिस इज द सेकेंड वे ऑफ क्रिएटिंग अ टेबल नाउ लेट एस लर्न अबाउट थर्ड वे ऑफ क्रिएटिंग अ टेबल हाउ यू कैन क्रिएट अ टेबल गो टू द इंसर्ट ऑप्शन गो टू टेबल and then the next option you see draw table draw table means you have to draw your table manually using the cursor when i click on draw table you see your mouse cursor changes to a pencil icon so you just have to click and drag your mouse i am just dragging my mouse you see now you can just draw the lines just like you draw in paint okay and you can just draw as many lines as you want 
and you can just draw the columns okay this is simply just you are doing what you are just drawing your table yourself using this cursor okay this is the third way of doing drawing a table simply you just have to go to insert go to table and you will select the draw table option okay now the last option that we have is a quick table quick tables means there is there are by default some tables that are drawn already in microsoft word you can choose any of these tables so just simply go to the insert option go to tables and you can choose just quick tables when you take your cursor on the quick tables you can see there are the tables that are drawn in microsoft word ye format already drawn hai you can choose any table and you can just accordingly change the contents of the table let's say i choose this table and this table is drawn here okay so now what you can do just simply take your cursor you can write your whatever data you want okay so you can just write edit the contents and you can change it accordingly okay this is what you do with quick tables quick tables means the by default the tables that are there present in word you can choose any table and you can just draw the table okay quick tables and you can choose any table and you will see the table is drawn on your word अगर आपको उसके कंटेंट्स को चेंज करना है टेक योर कर्सर एंड यू कैन डिलीट इट एंड राइट योर ओन कंटेंट्स ओके दिस इज द थर्ड वे ऑफ डूइंग द ड्राइंग द टेबल नाउ लेट्स से आई हैव रिटन द डाटा एंड आई वांट टू प्रेजेंट द डाटा इन द फॉर्म ऑफ टेबल सपोज ये मैंने डाटा ऑलरेडी लिख रखा है सीरियल नंबर यूनिट्स क्वांटिटी एंड आई हैव जस्ट रिटन इट लाइक दिस नाउ आई वांट दिस टेबल शुड बी दिस टेक्स्ट शुड बी कन्वर्टेड टू अ टेबल आई वांट दिस टेक्स्ट टेक्स्ट शुड बी रिटन इन द फॉर्म ऑफ टेबल ठीक है तो उसके लिए आप क्या करोगे फर्स्ट यू विल गो हेड एंड सिलेक्ट द डाटा आई हैव सिलेक्टेड दिस डाटा आई विल गो टू इंसर्ट आई विल गो टू टेबल एंड यू विल सी दिस ऑप्शन दैट सेज कन्वर्ट टेक्स्ट टू टेबल आई विल क्लिक ऑन दिस ऑप्शन यू विल जस्ट सिंपली प्रेस ओके एंड यू सी योर टेक्स्ट इज चेंज टू द टेबल सी अगेन दिस इज माई टेक्स्ट दैट आई हैव रिटर्न ओके I have written this text. I want to convert this text in the form of a table. So what I will do? I will select the text like this. Then I will go to insert, go to table, and you will just simply click the option convert text to table, and you will just simply press OK, and you can see your data is converted into a form of a table in the form of rows and columns. So this is how you convert the text to a table. So children you have learned how you can convert your data your uh, text in the form of a table so let's say this is my table now you just simply know how you can enter the data in the table so let's say i want to enter the data here i will take the cursor here i will write whatever you want to write serial number i will press tab key from the keyboard it will take the cursor to the next cell i write units i write expenses then i write sold in centers okay this is what how you enter the data so how you enter the data you will just simply take the cursor to the cell where you want to enter the data okay and then you can write the data using your keyboard okay and then you can just simply enter the data as you want using the tab key you can move to the next cell right and if you use shift plus tab it will take the cursor to the previous cell okay to take the cursor to the previous cell this if you want to move the cursor to the next cell you will just simply press tab key if you want to move the cursor to the previous cell you will just simply press shift and tab okay take the cursor click on the cell where you want to enter the data press tab key it will take the cursor to the next cell enter the data again i press tab key i enter the data i press tab key i enter the data okay if i want to move to the previous cell i will simply press shift and tab okay this is how you move in the table and how you enter the data in the cell okay now we will learn about more about tables in the rest of the video so stay tuned children thank you